kids podcast. <laughs> you can go slow. A kids podcast about. Good morning. My name is Tess, and I want to welcome you to today. Can you wave your hand and say, good morning, day? Can you put your hands on your heart and say, good morning, heart? And I want to say, good morning to you. I just love getting to start today with you as we check in, as we wake up our bodies, and as we think about what is in store for us today. Are you ready to start off our morning? Great. Can you jump up on your feet for me and get ready? Because today we are going to talk about making mistakes. And we're going to learn how we can celebrate those mistakes. How when we make a mistake, we can make it into a party. So we're going to have a bit of a mistake making party today. And then we're going to head out into our days, make as many mistakes as you make, and we're going to get together tonight and talk about them. So to start off, can you stretch your arms up over your head as far as you can up until the air? Good. Wiggle your fingers and then let your arms out and release them down by your sides. Good. And roll your shoulders back. Good. And now can you take your hands and, okay, you're going to fold them at your wrists. Good. And then you're just going to wiggle them back and forth like this. There you go. You got that. That's a fun little move. And now as you do this move, can you say, mistakes are A-OK. Ready? Mistakes are A-OK. Try it one more time. Mistakes are A-OK. Very, very good. Now, Mistakes are actually really, really important to make because every time that we make a mistake, we learn something new. And if we didn't make any mistakes, if we just did everything perfectly the first time, we would never have anything to learn and life would get really boring. So I think that mistakes are something that we should celebrate, celebrate and love because on the other side of every mistake is trying something new all over again. And I love that for you. I have something to tell you. It's very important. Did you know that every single person on the planet makes mistakes? All of those people that you know, the adults that you know, the other kids that you know, the people that you see on television, the people who play sports, all of these people in our whole world make big mistakes all the time. And because they make mistakes, they are able to learn more and keep going. So can you take your hands again, put them by your side, wiggle them back and forth, and can you say mistakes are A-OK? Good. Now, can you put your hands up in the air like we did at the first? Wiggle them like you are celebrating. Good. And now you're going to put your hands back down by your shoulders. Ready? Put your hands up. Wiggle them like you're celebrating. And now move them all the way down to your sides like you're doing a jazz hands here. Okay? So you're going to put your hands by your shoulders and then throw your arms up in the air. Wiggle your fingers and then wiggle them all the way down to your hands or by your sides. Yes, you're doing a very good job of that. Now, this time, as you throw your hands up in the air, can you say, I celebrate my mistakes, and then wiggle your fingers very dramatically down to your sides? (laughs) Okay, ready? So you're going to throw your hands up in the air. Whoosh, yes. Now, move your hands down, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. I celebrate my mistakes. Good. Now put your hands up to the side. Palms are facing down, and you're going to wiggle your hands. Mistakes are A-OK. One more time. Mistakes are A-OK. Hands, throw them up into the air. Wiggle your fingers. I celebrate my mistakes. Now, very dramatically, big jazz hands right down to the bottom. Now, this is something that you can do really anywhere. The grocery store, at school, anytime that you make a mistake. 
I recommend that you try saying both of these things and doing both of these dance moves. You will immediately feel a lot better. Maybe today you could teach someone else your mistake dance and teach them the affirmations that we say when we make mistakes. So I hope that you have a beautiful day with tons of mistakes in it. Do you want to try it one more time with me? Can you take your hands? Can you put them by your sides with your palms down? Good. Now wiggle them back and forth. You say mistakes are A-OK. Throw those hands up in the air. Wiggle your fingers. I celebrate my mistakes. Good. Now very dramatically bring your hands down as you wiggle your fingers all the way to your sides. Oh, I love you. I can't wait to see you tonight. We'll talk about some of the mistakes you made. We will celebrate them. And then it will be time for bed. I'm so excited for you and for your day. And I want to say thank you so much for starting today with me and for setting yourself up for a big heart kind of day. I can't wait to see you tonight and hear about all of the things that you did. Remember, there is nobody in the whole world with a heart just like yours. I love you, and I love your big heart so much. We know you value what you put in front of your kids, especially when it comes to screens and podcasts. That's why we're excited to share a new podcast from our friends at Sleepiest, creating bedtime stories to help your kids fall asleep fast. Hello, Abby here. If you've got children and find bedtimes a struggle, I'd like to tell you about Coco Sleep, a children's story podcast designed to make bedtime a dream. Coco Sleep turns a chaotic bedtime into cozy bonding time. The stories are delivered in a pace that gently slows. Rumor has it that no one's ever heard an ending. So search Coco Sleep on your favorite podcast app and let's make bedtime a dream. That's K-O-K-O Sleep and I'll see you there.